first someone said asset management okay yes sir and asset management first of all to have the assets in service now there is a book a book book is already there the book name is cmdb okay so i'm just giving you you just given your requirement i'm just giving the replies to you okay so see here there is something called cmdb configurational database management okay every company have so much of assets right what is the meaning of asset right you come to my house right you see in one tv first thing you see in one table second thing you see in one big birwa with a lot of money third thing you see in one small pin fourth thing now you can say these four things are my assets can you say that yes yes everyone yes, sir. can i say like these four things are my assets a spin a small pin or a big birwa with lot of money everything is my asset can i say like this yes 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 okay yes similarly okay if we see a company okay company will have so many assets when you see this way asset can be anything the definition of asset can be anything sir can you treat like in a washroom tissue paper is also asset sir yes how sir because company spent money on it if you see from one side we will be having an image that only laptops desktops computers hardware software they are only the asset no whatever the cost involved that can be considered as an asset understand my first thing yes yes okay yes but when it comes to it related asset management okay we don't treat tissue paper tissue paper paper pin everything as an assets but mainly we see something like okay to have the operations service operations it operations to run what are things needed tangible not tangible some there, there is no word there is a word called tangible okay which can be touched which cannot be touched right so there are few things where you can see which is an asset there are few things where you cannot see is also an asset okay example a laptop you brought it it's tangible thing you can see it correct can you see a laptop Yes. Mm, yes 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 right now in that laptop one application you installed let's say snagit application you installed snagit application have a license you purchased that license that license is 1 lakh rupee for 5 years can you see this can you touch this license no no so is that not an asset then intangible yes it is are you understanding ma now how we yeah. defining it okay so if you see this way i am just giving the cmdb definition many people will be getting lot of scare of understanding cmdb okay so let's make it very simple cmdb configurational management database okay database remove it okay database anyway we understood one hour discussion it database data building everything okay now which database configuration and management database which is configuration okay so i have a computer a company skfx company right a company means what okay it's a running entity with so many supportive activities supportive items what are the supportive items we see only humans physic okay Hum when you say company okay Uh, as someone said okay a country is not a soil but a country is okay people something correct desham ante matti kadu desham ante manushulu something right so we see humans here that definition will not apply here okay a company means 
people with assets, everything, tangible, <laughs> intangible, both things. Understand? <laughs> right? So this escape, ma, please keep it on mute. So this Escafax company is having, okay, these many resources. Let's say 25,000 people are there. Okay. And this Escafax company has so many other things like 15,000 laptops are there. Okay. 10,000 desktops are there. Okay. And 5, 500 servers are there. And that 500 servers, okay, extra 250 virtual servers are there. Okay. And then, okay, 1,500 printers are there. Okay, 2,000 scanners are there. Right? Now, this list will go on, go on, go on. If I say soft applications, okay, they have, okay, 900 applications they purchased, okay, with licenses. Okay, I can use dummy version of Office here. You, Whenever I launch Excel, you see one pop-up. Okay. It indicates that you don't have a license, but you are using it. That is guy. Something it will tell. Correct? But can I use the same version in an IT, IT company? No. 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 They have to purchase the license. Okay. So they may purchase group license, not independent license. For 1,000 people, one budget. They will take it. 2,000 people, okay, one license. So they will use it. Concurrent license, single, okay. There are so many things will come here. License management, okay. Terminologies will come, right? So now this and this every now if you go on, go on, go on. Now computers, laptop, desktop, okay, printer, scanners, people, applications, licenses, everything. Correct? It will go on, right? If I start writing it, it will go on, go on, go on, right? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. Sir, then. Where we are handling this data, sir? Is there any place where I can handle the data? I want to see all my computers. Okay, so I have some X computer, and X computer is assigned to, okay, maybe Baswaraj Garu today. Right? Now, after five months, he left the organization. So, what, what we do? We take the computer and then we format it and then we reimage it and then we assign this same x application x computer i means laptop to maybe bhavana garu she is a new employee right so where you see this change a computer okay the computer is assigned to whom where you all see this okay for this there is something called cmdb Okay, if you go to CMDB, so ServiceNow platform hosts the CMDB data also, first statement. Generally, outside companies to manage the CMDB data, they will be using so many applications, third party applications. Okay, and they will be spending a lot of money there. Okay, so for us, ServiceNow also, ServiceNow itself will give the solution. So if you just go to ServiceNow and then say CMDB, Okay, so you see, right? No, it's, it's just a computer. I'll just type computer. Okay, so configuration. If I say configuration, okay, this is part where, go me, give me one second. Let me open application, configuration, okay? So if you just go to configuration, right? You see all the CMDB components will be listed here under this configuration application. Where is that? Where is that? Ah, here is that. Okay. So we don't want everything. Okay. We want at least one thing. Okay. Applications. I will open one thing. Application. And then I will open. Okay. All servers. Right. In that all servers also. Maybe Com Tomcat servers. This server. Linux server. Something. Then. Okay. Ser database servers. Okay. We, we can go. We no need to do this much of deep understanding. So networks, how many things are there? Where are desktops, man? Computers. Where do you see computers here? Do you see computers? Here? Ah, okay. So computers, servers, right? So if you just go, this company have these many applications they are using. Snagit application, MS Office application, Reader application, Writer application, that application, this application, everything. 
Okay. Now, if you go inside of this application, okay, it may have the license also, if it have it. Okay. So, this is how, this is a CMDB. And this is one asset, asset management. Correct? Now, this application, you can also see something else like, there is another place where you can see this application is installed in these many computers. Okay. In organization, Adobe Acrobat is installed in, okay, thousand computers. Now, you can see those computer list also here somewhere. Right? So, these are the computers that you com your company have it. Okay, with OS. So, this computer, if I open it, right? So this is the computer and this is right now assigned to this person, okay? And this one have this all the details, OS, QS, everything. And we can also see in this computer, these many softwares are installed. So let's, I will show you one up, one computer. Just give me one second. Just uh, give me one second. I will show you one computer where it have a lot of softwares installed. Then you will understand what I am trying to say. Come. Okay. Huh. Uh, this is good, small one. Okay. Now if you see this computer, where is that? 15 or 14. Okay. If you see this computer, in this computer, okay, these many softwares are installed. Office, Acrobat, Reader, this box, that box. Okay. Now, if you see, this is one table. Applications will go on store in one table. Computers will go on store in one table. And there is a relationship. These applications are installed in this computer. Understand, <coughs> my everyone? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. So, yes, sir. this, no, please keep it unmute me. So this is what CMDB, okay? And if you just go beyond servers, okay, that, this, everything. In a simplest way, this is CMDB and asset management, as you said, is already there. Whatever you said, everything is there in service now. We don't need to create a separate application for it. So this is what my justification for your requirement. No is the answer. Understood? I, I said no to this requirement with this justification. Understood why I said no? Yes. Yes, yes sir. Sir, got it. Because we already have that kind of setup. Correct. So, when you see something called CMDB in job description, don't be panic first of all. CMDB is not a separate technology. It's a separate thing. It's not service now thing. Service now host the CMDB. That's why they will expect CMDB knowledge also. Sir, what we do, sir, here? Okay, we load the computers, laptops, desktop from external sources to service now. How we load, sir? Using our phase four integrations. Okay, so that's why people will say, sir, can you teach CMDB, sir? Can you teach that, sir? Can you teach this, sir? Without knowing what is CMDB. Right? Yeah, got it. Good. Everyone got the definition of CMDB now? Is that easy, first of all? Yep. Yes. yes so Very tedious. <laughs> very tedious. <laughs> it is very <laughs> lengthy, yeah. So it's not difficult, but it's too much lengthy. CMDB is not a simple entity to understand. If you just go on, go on, go on. Okay, CMDB have a huge ocean. I will show you the different way. Okay. So, sir... You shown one computer, one laptop, one server, one this one, one that one, right? Like this, how many things we have, is it, sir? Okay, go to tables, right? Then type one small thing called table, system definition tables. Don't scare me, I'm just giving, okay, the just information, that's it. I'm not make, I'm, I don't want to make you scare, okay? So CMDB, right? These many things are getting stored in service now, which are related to CMDB. 
it can be computer it can be application okay it can be software it can be hardware it can be server it can be okay that server this server understood now i showed one sample of this okay maybe i can show one more sample of server i can show one more sample of application understanding it now yes yes okay so our service now platform have a great 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 okay uh, feature to store your company cmdb data that's why we get the cmdb everyone will ask what is okay cmdb cmdb this is why you need to at least understand which tables are hosting which data you should at least know okay cmdb data cmdb appl applications will store here cmdb underscore ca underscore computer then computer data will store here servers but at least some 10 tables not now after 55 classes okay good now i'll go beyond okay so got it my everyone clear